America, Tom Hand here with Americana Corner. Today we are discussing the life of Thomas Paine. The two most influential books of the Revolutionary Era were written by Thomas Paine, an immigrant from England. He was born on February 9, 1737, the son of a corset maker, and attended school until the age of 13. Paine's early adulthood included numerous jobs and two failed marriages. In 1774, he was forced to sell his household possessions to avoid debtor's prison. Payne's fortunes changed later that year when Benjamin Franklin gave him a letter of recommendation to Franklin's friends in Philadelphia. Payne soon emigrated there and became a newspaper editor, printing politically charged articles. In January 1776, Paine published a brilliant pamphlet entitled Common Sense that argued for American independence. In December, Paine followed this up with the American Crisis, an inspiring pamphlet with a call to arms to help fill the depleted ranks of the Continental Army. George Washington was so impressed that he read its opening lines to his troops before crossing the Delaware. These are the times that try men's souls. The summer soldier and the sunshine patriot will, in this crisis, shrink from the service of his country. But he that stands by it now deserves the love and thanks of man and woman. Payne's two pamphlets shaped the American mindset like nothing else. However, Payne's star soon faded in America as he became more radical in his views. In 1787, Payne departed for Europe and continued writing until returning to America in 1803. He spent his final years in New Rochelle, New York and died on June 8, 1809, a relatively forgotten man. Next week, we will discuss Thomas Paine's greatest work, his pamphlet, Common Sense. Until next time, may your love of country lead you.